So um, let's talk about the uh, default size limit for a, a OST or PST file in Outlook. So um, you would notice that if your mailbox is larger than 50 gig um, and you reach this limit because Microsoft by default uh, sets the limit of an OST file or PST file to 50 gig and uh, it is recommended that you stay uh, under this limit but if you do have to go beyond this 50 gig which sometimes happens and I have had this uh, with some users uh, using Office 365 um, you would have to uh, do the following uh, registry changes to accommodate uh, this uh, change. So by default, um, shared folders are cached, uh, are in cache mode in both uh, Outlook 2010 and 2013, Office 365. Um, so when doing this uh, registry changes, uh, you have to be careful because you can sometimes create problems for uh, the Windows boot or it could cause problems with Office. So it is recommended that you uh, back up the registry before doing this. Uh, so in case some problems ha a problem happens, you can then uh, very easily restore. So we would do talk about uh, registry backup in another video, um, but let's uh, continue. Uh, so the uh, registry entry labeled max file size is uh, the entry that uh, Outlook uses to determine the maximum file size of the OST. So when your OST file grows to this maximum size, um, Outlook will stop uh, the OST from growing beyond this size. So you will notice uh, errors um, and if you wanted to go beyond this limit, uh, you can do this by increasing uh, the, um, by making changes to the Windows registry as follows. So you would use the uh, reg edit or registry edit exe to uh, increase the maximum size. Uh, of these uh, registry entries. There are two entries uh, that we would make this change to and the um, depending on whether you're using Outlook 2013 or Office 365, the, uh, the key that you would make changes to would change as follows. So in this case, if you're using Outlook 2013, uh, it would be in the uh, office slash 15 dot uh, registry path. And if it's like uh, Office 365 or Outlook 2019, 2021, so on, it would be uh, in this key uh, 16.0. So let's uh, see how we can make this change. Uh, in uh, let me show you how to do this.